good morning. I was just going to get the guys up for a run. Oh, no, I wouldn't do that. Why don't you sit down? Ursula, I'm a very direct person, so I'm just going to cut right to the chase. All right. When we came down here to Florida with the children, we were hoping that this would be a wonderful vacation, but so far it hasn't been. Oh, did they do something wrong? Well, no, not exactly. It's just that this is a small condo. You're a big girl, and quite frankly, you're just bothering the heck out of people. <laughs> I'm sorry. I never meant to bother anyone. Oh, I think deep down you might have enjoyed it just a little. Why do you say that? Because if I were you, and in many ways I am, I would have enjoyed it. I've tried to be unobtrusive. Ursula, let's get serious. This is not an unobtrusive outfit. I mean, these are not clothes that scream, yes, my job is taking care of small children. <laughs> well, I could go change. No, no, I don't think that would help. I think you're just one of these people who's too much. Too much? Yes. Julia and Charlene and Mary Jo would never tell you so. They're too nice. But I can tell you because I'm too much, too. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just don't know what you mean. I mean, your smile is too big, your heart is too big, and quite frankly, your breasts are too big. So what are you saying? I'm saying I want you to take your big knockers and hit the road. <laughs> if you wouldn't mind. Well, I guess there's only room for one queen bee around here. That's right. And I'm afraid I'm it. I admire your directness. I thought you would. Well, I'll just be getting my things. I'll write you a check. And don't worry, I won't tell anyone about our little talk. I'll just say that you were called home to Denmark. Right. Well, girls, happy vacation.